Okay, I'm missing a tarantula. What the f is that? Watching this video, you probably guess I actually really love Animal Crossing. When they came on the Switch, I went ham on it and I beat it in seven days. So while I was playing, I kind of realized, you know, I should probably record or write down what exactly happened, and I kind of want to share my experience with Animal Crossing with you guys. So this will be literally the first two weeks of Animal Crossing experience from me, and hopefully we share the same things and you guys can relive those moments here and there. So let's just get started. All right, Nook asked me to name my island. Hmm. Finally got it. It's going to be called Juicy Ranch. Oh, you know, at least people know it's me. Let's see who our villagers are. Okay, so we got Cherry. It's kind of emo, but you know, she's cute. I, I can work with her, I guess. And Poncho. He literally looks like a, a baby. I guess I'm starting off with this. I really want like a penguin or octopus or alligator, but okay. All right, let's start this off. What is the first initial death? Wow, guess I gotta go fishing for a while. All right, I did all my fishing. I'm halfway through my depth. I am ready to, what the, the miles? Apparently everything's locked because there's a river and I can't go over the river. I can't go up elevation. So I am stuck doing nothing and I can't use the airport to visit my friends. So time skip. Finally, I can upgrade my home, which is going to be I can also upgrade the store. So I need 30 wood. Which is easy, I got all from the trees. 30 iron. <laughs> Where the f does it get iron from? That like comes off like maybe once or twice a rock. Oh, so in the Nook Miles, you can buy a ticket and then I send you over to other islands to get mint materials. Okay, that makes more sense. I finally got a pole. I can finally explore this island. Everything's too tall for me to reach. There's like three fossils there. I want to get them. Also, I got a shovel now, so I can finally get them, but they're just literally out of the way. I guess it's time for me to donate to Blathers, whenever that is. Okay, no, I guess not. I guess I have to pile up all the fishes here. You know what? I'm just going to time one more time. All right, I paid off my debt, and the next step is going to be... <laughs> I'm going to use my ladders now. We can finally climb everywhere. Wow, there's a lot of weed around this area. Oh, my friends want to visit my island. What are you guys doing? Why are you guys cutting down my trees? Stop cutting down my trees, it's on my fruit! Was, 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 was. Got an orfish. And everyone still thinks I'm ugly still because I don't care about game medicine. Day four, I finally paid off my debt. And I have a new How is it doubling amount? I can finally get new villages. I'm so excited. I have to build furniture for them? Oh, that should be easy. How much wood do I need? Guess I'm gonna explore some islands now. Need wood, need iron, need stone, need fruits. Oh my gosh, this is gonna take forever. Why are there so many ugly animals here? You're ugly, you're ugly, you're ugly. No, you're cute, but eh, whatever. I really wonder how I get villagers move in. Apparently they're not, so I don't know where do I talk to. The people I talked to that I thought were ugly or not ugly were supposed to move into my village. Like, oh my God, I just wasted 10,000 miles just to get materials when I should have recruited villagers. Okay, um, I'm just gonna take the first three I can find right now. Um, okay. You're a big top. Okay, you're coming to my island. Sure, why not? You're kind of cute. Okay, puddles. Okay, sure, you're weird, but whatever. I just need them. I just want to move on so I can go faster in the game. Okay, uh, last one. Uh, okay, that's a creep. Okay, okay, sure, you can join my island too. All right, next day, we build a bridge. So that's pretty exciting. Why does it look like it's a funeral? Cherry saw that we have a new villager moving in and she gave them a manhole cover. I paid off my death again, so you know, I should be almost, what the f how's it again? Oh, this is Big Top, he's, okay, he's kind of weird, but you know, I'll, I'll live with that. Okay, Puddles finally moved in, and she looks like she is wearing underwear on her face. You know, like, I'm gonna get more villagers anyway, so I don't have to care about the ones right now. I really doubt I'll keep her. I built a flower garden. I should really become a gardener after this. Garbage is important in this game. I can make garbage wallpaper. I am fishing for garbage no matter what. Give me a boot. Okay, I'm missing a tarantula. What the f is that? <laughs> Finally. Bye, God. A tarantula. I'm already done with tarantulas. So I don't have to worry about a scary creature like that again. So, we're good. <laughs> Cherry Poncho keep giving me free stuff. So, you know why? I, I actually really like them now. The other villagers need to step up a bit. I got stung by a wasp again. And Puddles gave me medicine when the others didn't. Puddles, you're my new best friend. 
you can buy an Animal Crossing Switch. I'm kinda rich, so why not? I gotta show my dominance to my villagers. So Ava's moving in today, but she doesn't have like bridges or anything. She's in the middle of nowhere on my island. So I have no idea how she's going to make friends on this island. Wait, I can order DIYs now? I can make a Gundam? Oh my god, I love this game. We're gonna build this right now. So it turns out for the Gundam situation, you need a rocket, which is a random generated prize for the shooting star, which happens maybe once or twice a month. You also need DIY for the golden armor to build, followed by 10 gold nuggets, and 30 rusted parts, which you get from Gulliver. And if you know about Gulliver, you have to do this stupid mission over and over again. So you gotta see Gulliver 30 times, which is not gonna happen in the next month. Rez's commerce finally opened up and we get to see Isabel. I have never been so happy in my life. Nook told me to build a new campsite so that we can have new villagers. Okay, fine, I'll build that right now. I pay off my debt for one more time. I can't wait for more How am I supposed to make that much money? Like I, in, in like a day or two, like that's, this is gonna take me like a month. So it's a thing apparently called r slash AC turnips. Holy someone has a 500 turnip. All right. Money, here I come. I've been waiting for one hour. I'm like one of the top comments right now and uh, I haven't been selected. So this is going to take forever and I've commented on 10 different other posts too. So, you know, screw it. I'm just going to make the money the old fashioned. Someone has? Let me in. So I pay off the debt for the basement. So. <gasps> I'm free! <laughs> oh, Phil moved in the island. I can't say no to you, apparently. Okay, welcome to the island. I guess I'm gonna kick him out first. All right, finally got my evaluation for my island. Let's see what it is. And Isabel, tell me it's a one. It's a place I've been quietly watching. It's a secret to everybody. I don't want it to be famous. You son of a that's not why you give it a one star. You're supposed to, like, just because you want to be alone, that's not me. Get off the island. Who, who wrote this island? I bet it was. Phil. Goldie finally moved in today, so you know, she's kind of cute, she likes reading books, and she has nothing to talk about, she has nothing. Man, she is actually a really boring villager. Finally also got two stars now, so this is probably based on how many villagers you have, like, doesn't really matter. You're ugly, you're ugly, you're ugly, you're ugly. I'm gonna take you, Julia, because I have no more Nook Miles now. Come on over to Juicy Ranch. That's cute. Cherry keeps sending me gifts and letters. I'm sorry I like my villagers now. Oh, today's Ava's birthday. I'm gonna give her something nice. I guess like a blender, because she looks like she likes making eggs. There are Power Ranger outfits in this game. I am buying seven copies of each. Every single villager is going to be wearing a Power Ranger outfit after this. So I apparently can use amiibo cards for people to move in. Hey, Bengal. You're moving into my village now. Got three star review from KK Slider. It's time. Who's Violet? I thought Bengal's moving in. Like, okay. So for my villagers, we have Cherry, Poncho, Puddles, Big Top, Ava, Phil, Goldie, and Julia. So then there should be two more spots left. Bengal's one of them. I've never met Violet at all on my island. What the f Violet took my last house. How the f is get someone I want to move in now? Look. You sold my island to a random stranger I never even talked to. Why would you do that? Don't give me a thousand miles. I want a person I will love, not someone I will hate for the rest of my life on this island. I will kick you out, Violet, every way I can. So apparently that doesn't work. Apparently that kind of resets them because you're interacting with them. So instead of going negative one, you go zero every time. I guess I'll just ignore her for the rest of the game. Maybe she'll move up from there. I have one more fish in April and I'm done. All I need is the barrel knife fish. Not sea bass, sea bass, sea bass, four fish, sea bass, sea bass. What the f Why is it taking so long? Apparently barrel knife fish is a small fish, like a mackerel. Mackerel, 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 mackerel. 250 tries. Finally got it. We're done April. We can move on to May. Oh my god, KK Sly is here. I'm so excited. And I be Animal Crossing in seven days. I am so disgusting. Maybe I should probably stop. <gasps> I can build my island the way I want with terraforming. Okay, I'm done terraforming. I guess I can finally play the game properly. What the f Why is Violet still on my island? F you, Violet. We're gonna kick you out. Uh, sure. Kit, you're moving to my island now. Screw Violet. I don't care. Let's go. Wait, Goldie, you wanna move out? Why? Like, 
I made it. This, this island is great for you. I love you, boring girl. I talked to Goldie. She says she doesn't want to move. Let's figure out who the hell she talked to last. You talked to Violet last. We're kicking out Violet right now. We're time skipping three days. We're gonna make sure that Kit's moving in, Vi's moving out. We're gonna make God sure she's gone. Well, since I'm time skipping, I might as well buy some turnips and then move in the future and then we should be fine. So I gave Kangaroo three different gifts. She's gonna move in. I'm very excited for her to move in. My turnips. Look at my turnips. Violet, that Violet. You knew I was gonna be so distracted from Goldie moving out, so you told her to kick her out. And now I'm sad, I was sad, so I had to make sure I was rushing. And when I rushed around, you hit me where it hurts. My money. Now I am less richer than I used to be, and now I'm upset, and now you're gone, so you know, f you, Violet. CJ has a fishing tournament. I am so excited to play this. It's actually, you get double to triple the points if you have friends coming over, so this is actually really fun. And you get that magical wand, which is really sweet. Well, you know, at least I got a cool cola fish trophy, so you know, I like it. Oh, Flex here. Let's try that thing too. I'm pretty sure I get a cool dragonfly trophy. Flick, what the f? Why would you? What? That's so horrifying! I'm never talking to you again, Flick! Oh, today's Cherry's birthday! I am so excited! I love you, Cherry, so much. Cherry's weird, but you know, she's still the best. Yeah, I love Cherry today. Four, five, six, six pack dragon, you're coming to my island! Wait, this is the wrong game. I finally added 250 fences, I've added all the flowers, I've added all the DIY logs, and we have five stars! Finally! Oh my god! There are eggs everywhere! I just want to catch a different fish or a bug or whatever thing! Okay, what's the grand prize for collecting all the zipper That is... Surprise? That looks like a I should probably talk to Sable in the clothing shop. Say, why do you have such a sad storyline? I'm going to teach Poncho a bad word. <laughs> Ava knows the bad word too now. Poncho, you're not supposed to teach people this bad word! Oh god! Puzzles, what kind of fight are you in right now? Poncho keeps telling me to work out. I don't know why, Poncho. Poncho, I'm not that, like, that unfit. Oh, I got Kit Kat or whatever it's called. Kid, the cool kid or Kiko or whatever. So, ah, this cute guy wants to move in. Sure, why not? You want to kick out Cherry? I will remember you. Will you? You Kit Kat, you Get out of my I hope you get neutered. Oh, safe to say is he's not gonna be moving in. All right, so this is my review of my crib. You walk into the area, you get to check this out. This is actually really cool because you got a TV with the switch on and you get all the stuff over here. You got family room over here. Uh, you got a music room and you can, like get the clouds moving, like fog machine over here and all the KKK albums all you want. My room is where you can take a shower and take a at the same time and go to sleep right there. Uh, I'm in the basement, you get chill there, uh, you can see my trophies over there and the pool over there and then upstairs is the place where all the guests go, this is where I make money with my vending machines and my video game arcades. Oh my god, Ava's actually moving out. You know, I've liked all my villagers so... I'm sorry Ava, you're leaving. Alright, it's okay. I'll see you around Ava. That f didn't give me a photo, that means we weren't best friends. What the f Ava? We were supposed to be best friends right there! Now it's time to get a scorpion. <laughs> God. All right. I wonder if I could do it again. <laughs> nope, nope, never mind. No, nope, I can't do this again. A million dollar crown in the game. Do I buy it? Of course I do. I'm a G. Holy shit, that's a huge shark. Cher Cherry wants to move my off my island. No, never leave my island, Cherry. We're best friends forever. All right, good, you're staying. For now, wait, what do you mean by that? I finally finished getting every fossil in the game. So, let's see what we get as a prize. Our humble museum's reputation is growing because of you. Thank you for your commitment for collecting and donating all the fossils. And my prize is... Nothing. Not even an achievement or a prize or anything. Flatters. I did all this work for you and nothing. What? You know what? It's probably time to, for me to go outside. Oh my god, so bright! Thanks again for watching, guys. Oh my god, I hope you guys had a lot of fun seeing my experience with Animal Crossing. If you guys like this video, well, 
like and like, subscribe, and comment about what you guys liked about the video. And if this video gets about 10,000 views, we'll make another video, and I'll buy some actual streaming supplies. I'll, I'll actually buy a capture card and actually record the gameplay so you guys can see it. Except I actually can't show Poncho because the word I taught him is a very bad word, so I actually can't stream that. So you know, if you guys want to see more videos like this, you know what to do: like, comment, and I hope to see you guys next time. So yeah, Animal Crossing. So I just want to say a special thank you to um, everyone who helped me make the video. So up front, my best friend Kat, she helped me get a lot of these clips. Well, I got her a switch for a wedding, and she's been playing Animal Crossing with me nonstop for the last three weeks. So. Thank you so much, Kat. You're my best friend. I'll put your little YouTube link over here so you should check her out too. Um, my best friends Ricky, Arun, Chris um, for helping me out with um, abusing the turnover market. Uh, my friend Silo, Eileen, Marina, uh, Gino, the list goes on. Thanks again for playing Animal Crossing. It's actually a really fun game thanks to you guys. So yeah, um, hopefully we can keep making more videos like these.